Let's hit it. And welcome to Alzheimer's Speaks Radio. I'm your host, Lori LeBay, and I'm so excited that you're joining us today. We are going to have a fascinating conversation, as usual, as we learn from people all around the world at all ages and stages of life. Stay tuned as we shift our dementia care from crisis to comfort. All right, here we go. What you think about? Hi, everyone, and welcome to Alzheimer's Speaks Radio. I'm glad you came back. If you liked our opening song, it's called Clarion Call by the Mark Arneson Band, featuring Maya Dore. And you can download that on any of your favorite music platforms. For those of you that are new to Alzheimer's Speaks, we're about sound information, not just sound bites. We like to have a real conversation with our guests. And so we'll be chatting for about an hour before we start. I'm just going to give a shout out to the Memory Cafe directory. I absolutely adore their work and I highly recommend um, people with dementia and their families uh, participate in a Memory Cafe either near them or really it can be anywhere in the world because they're going virtually now and you can get more information by going to memorycafe.com. I also, uh, I'm sorry, you can go to memorycafedirectory.com for more information. Also, I just want to let people know that all of our shows have been archived and we've been doing this for many, many years. So there's lots of information at Alzheimer's Speaks um, regarding our shows. We also have a YouTube channel that has a lot of the recordings, which are um, video for our radio show. We have dementia chats. Um, there's so a ton of, ton of resources out there. So welcome everybody to our third Sing Along, Sing Alone with Barbara Lee from Music Memories in Minnesota. I'm Lori LeBay, the host of Alzheimer Speaks, and um, we should just have a fun time. Barbara's got uh, about 14 songs I think she's picked out and we'll have a lot of fun singing to those songs as we go. For those of you that are new um, to these sing-alongs, Barbara Lee is, is our phenomenal singer and she she's a vocalist and guitarist and she has a passion for working with older adults and people with disabilities. And so um, her whole thing is to sing to improve life and you know lift the spirit. And so we will have a lot of fun um, doing that. So Barbara Lee, I'm going to let you go ahead and um, take it from here. I know you've got planned probably um, 45 minutes or so for us um, to sing along with you. I'm going to start with a song from the 1970s instead of from 1892. And this song was written by Mac Davis and it says exactly what I believe. I believe in music, and I believe in love. I believe in music. Oh, I believe in love. Yes, I do now. I, I believe in music. Oh, I believe in love. 
I believe in music, music and love. Thank you. Well, we're going to be doing songs actually from, oh, I don't know, the 30s and 40s up into the 70s today, about a 40-year range of popular music. In 1944, Doris Day became a hit with this song as she sang with the Les Brown Orchestra. Gonna take a sentimental journey Gonna set my heart at ease I'm gonna take a sentimental journey Sentimental journey home I got my bag, I got my reservation I spent each dime I could afford And like a child in wild anticipation I long to hear that all aboard. Seven, that's the time we leave at seven. I'll be waiting up for heaven. Counting every mile, a railroad track that takes me back. Good singing, Linnea. I never thought my heart could be so yearning. Why did I decide to roll? I gotta take a sentimental journey, sentimental journey home. Sing it with me, sentimental journey. One more time, sentimental journey home. What a great song! What a great song. You know, Doris Day lived uh, last year. She died at 97 years old. She had a very wonderful long life. It was great. A year before that, 1943, we were doing novelty songs, silly songs, like Mersey Dotes and Dozy Dotes and Little Lambs Eat Ivy, a Kiddly Ivy too, wouldn't you? Mersey dotes and dozy dotes and little lambs eat ivy. A kid'll eat ivy too, wouldn't you? Now, if the words sound queer and funny to your ear, a little bit jumbled and jiving, sing mares eat oats and does eat oats and little lambs eat ivy. Mersey dotes and dozy dotes and little lambs eat ivy. A kid'll eat ivy too, wouldn't you, wouldn't you? A kid'll eat ivy too, wouldn't you? Boop, boop, be doo. Great job there. Thank you so much. I'll turn it back to Barbara Lee. All right, so uh, last time one of our faithful fans said, what about more Broadway music? And I think even movie music, fabulous. So remember 1959 was Sound of Music. Do a deer, a female deer, ray, a drop of golden sun. Come on, Bob. Me, a name I call myself. Fa, a long, long way to run. So a needle pulling thread. So a needle pulling thread. La, a note to follow, so tea, a drink with jam and bread, that will bring us back to do. Let's do it again. Ready? Do, a deer, a female deer, ray, a drop of golden sun, me, a name I call myself, but a long, long way to run. So, a needle pulling thread, yeah, a note to follow soon, tea, a drink with jam and bread, that will bring us back to, do, re, mi, fa, so, la, ti, do, so, 
don't. Another song from Sound of Music, Edelweiss, Edelweiss. Every morning you greet me, small and white, clean and bright. You look happy to meet me. Blossom of snow, may you bloom and grow, bloom and grow forever. Edelweiss, Edelweiss, bless my homeland forever. Now this part I'm not sure about. Blossom of snow, I hope we're done. Blossom of snow, may you bloom on me. Bloom, oh yes, forever. Edelweiss, Edelweiss, bless my homeland forever, forever. Now, 1966, Cabaret came out on uh, Broadway, and it sh they've done the show again, actually, um, when uh, Broadway's not dark. Anyway, the song is from Cabaret. It's the title song. Liza Minnelli is the one who uh, made it a hit. Joel Gray was also in Cabaret, the original. And the song goes like this. What good is sitting alone in your room? Come hear the music play. Here we go. Ready? Life is a cabaret, old chum. It's only a cabaret. No use permitting some prophet of doom to wipe every smile away. Life is a cabaret, old chum, so come to this cabaret. Come taste the wine, come hear the band, come blow your horn, start celebrating. Right this way, your table's waiting. Start by admitting from cradle to tomb that it really isn't that long a stay. Life is a cabaret, old chum. It's only a cabaret, old chum. So come to that cabaret. The people who made that a hit were uh, Candor and Ebb that did several other shows, too. Uh, but that was really one of their uh, big, uh, big hits was Cabaret. Remember this song? This actually is from the 20s, a gospel song. This little light of mine, I'm going to let it shine. This little light of mine, good Bob, I'm going to let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine, let it shine, let it shine, let it shine. Sing it, Judy, here we go. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. Oh, baby, this little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine, let it shine, let it shine, let it shine. All around the neighborhood, I'm gonna let it shine. All around the neighborhood, I'm gonna let it shine. All around the neighborhood, I'm gonna let it shine, let it shine, let it shine, let it shine. Everywhere I go, I'm gonna let it shine, baby. Everywhere I go, I'm gonna let it shine. Everywhere I go, I'm gonna let it shine. Let it shine, let it shine, let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. 
This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. Let it shine, let it shine, let it shine. Walking up and down the street, I'm gonna let it shine. Walking up and down the street, I'm gonna let it shine. Walking up and down the street, I'm gonna let it shine. Let it shine, let it shine, let it shine. One last time, ready? Here we go. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine. I'm gonna let it shine, 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 let it shine. Cha cha cha. Thank you. Good job singing there, Chuck. <laughs> I have a terrible voice. Stop it. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's just nice to see people engaging and, and having fun. So that's what it's yeah, all about. It really is. It really is nice to see people singing along. I can't hear you because you're muted. That's why we came up with Sing Along, Sing Alone. Well, another thing I want to tell you about. My brothers know this this story. I used to sing for TV and radio and industrial film commercials. My claim to fame, for those of you from Minneapolis or that live in Israel that used to live in Minneapolis, was this song. I, about seven o'clock every morning, it would wake me up. Gabbards, see what's in store at Gabbards. You'll find the look that you're looking for. See what's in store at Gabbards. And then I did, Buttries is having your kind of sale at your kind of fashions, at your kind of prices too. Buttries is having your kind of sale. And another one be that they never said. Did you sell many from that? It. Did you, what? Barbara, did you sell many from that? <laughs> no, but Chuck, what's so funny is that um, there was a song that I did that was on an album that was sold in hardware stores. That's about as big as I got. That's about as big as I got. Here's the third one. Come on, let's celebrate. And let your spirits rise. Come join hands with me. And see what you gotta be. Old home cottage cheese. <laughs> anyway, it paid for a lot of my college. It was fabulous. Patty Page, 1952. I was one year old when she sang, How much is that doggy in the window? Arf, arf. The one with the waggly tail. How much is that doggy in the window? I do hope that doggy's for sale. I don't want a bunny or a kitty. I don't want a parrot that talks. I don't want a bowl full of fishies. Cause you can't take a fish for a walk. How much is that doggy in the window? The one with the waggly tail. How much is that doggy in the window? I do hope that dog is for sale. How much is that doggy in the window? Oh my gosh. I was going to get a cat recently. Bob, I never told you. I was going to get a cat. I did research. I went to the Humane Society. I picked him up. I pet him. I pet him. I, I, I really was close. But then I realized there's so much work. <laughs> They're too much work for me. And I decided here, just a minute, don't go away. I got a stuffed animal. 
Believe it or not, it's a cat. I don't like the snout of it. It's not doesn't look like a cat, but it really is very soft. I got myself a cat after all. Oh my gosh. Not no work. No work at all. About the same time the cabaret came out uh, in the 60s, 66, Louis Armstrong was singing a wonderful, wonderful song. In fact, that's the title part of it is what a wonderful world, what a wonderful world. I see trees of green and red roses too. I see them blue for me and for you. And I think to myself, what a wonderful world. I see skies of blue and clouds of white, the bright blessed day and the dark sacred night. And I think to myself, everybody, what a wonderful world. The colors of the rainbow so pretty in the sky are also on the faces of the people going by. I see friends shaking hands, saying, how do you do? They're really saying, I love you. I hear babies crying. I watch them grow. They'll learn much more than I'll ever know. And I think to myself, ready? What a wonderful world. I think to myself, what a wonderful world. Mm, what a beautiful song. Barbara, how long have you been playing? Is that Chuck? Yeah. Chuck, I have been playing guitar for 56 years. You and don't I'm look only, and I'm, you don't and look, I'm only 30. Isn't you don't that look weird? 30. You don't look yeah. 30. Yeah, thank you. No, I'm 69 now, and I started playing guitar. I started with piano when I was six. And then I met a guitar when I was 12, and that did it. I really fell in love with playing the guitar. And by 13, I was entertaining with my dad in nursing homes. That's great. And that's, that's great. 56 years. That's great. Yeah, thank, so, you. thank you for doing this. Thank you so much, Chuck, for being a part of this. You know, at a time when people, many people are still stay-at-home orders and stuff, uh, it really, I'm honored to be able to do this for people uh so you thank you so much thanks i'm gonna just ask chuck quick what state are you in <laughs> what do you think i <laughs> uh, i don't know if you're in minnesota we got people from all over the globe so <laughs> uh from massachusetts boston. Yeah. Okay. boston okay well your accent isn't that strong compared to some people i know out there so i wasn't quite sure Thanks for sharing that. You're a welcome. Thanks for asking. Lois Jean, how are you doing? There. How are you doing? Just fine. Just enjoying your music. Good. Enjoying my music. Thank you, Lois. And Carol, are you doing okay? We're good. I was just outside in the garden. Came back in to check on mom. Fabulous. Fabulous. And where does your mom live? We're in Lancaster County, Pennsylvania. Oh, my gosh. Are you part of a memory cafe? Yeah. Well, we um, are part of the memory center. We did um, sing for a moment here um, at Christmas, and then we were going to do one in the spring, but we it got canceled, obviously. Uh -huh. But they do, um, they, we meet, you meet once a week for like eight weeks, and then they did a show. So. Wow, that's fabulous. That's fabulous. All right, well, welcome. Thanks for coming. Four of my other si favorite singers, their early stuff more than her, their later stuff, is actually the Beatles. The Beatles. They were on Ed Sullivan in 1964. Amazing. So here's the scoop. 
I want you to learn the chorus if you don't know the song because it repeats four times. Let it be, let it be, let it be, let it be. Whisper words of wisdom, let it be. Okay, so here's how it goes. When I find myself in times of trouble, Mother Mary comes to me, speaking words of wisdom, let it be. And in my hour of darkness, she is standing right in front of me, speaking words of wisdom, let it be. Here we go, four times. Let it be, let it be, let it be, let it be. Good, David. Whisper words of wisdom, let it be. Again, let it be, let it be, let it be, let it be. Whisper words of wisdom, let it be. And when the broken hearted people living in the world agree, there will be an answer, let it be. For though they may be parted, there is still a chance that they will see. There will be an answer. Let it be. Here we go. Let it be. Let it be. Let it be. Let it be. Whisper words of wisdom, let it be. Again, here we go. Let it be, let it be, let it be, let it be. There will be an answer, let it be. You know, Paul McCartney's going to be, um, let's see, 78 years old this year. <laughs> amazing, amazing. Here we go. And when the night is cloudy, there is still a light that shines on me. Shine until tomorrow. Let it be. I wake up to the sound of music. Mother Mary comes to me, speaking words of wisdom. Let it be. 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 Speaking words of wisdom. Let it be, let it be, let it be, let it be, let it be. Whisper words of wisdom, let it be. Thank you. That song was written in 1969 and released in 1970, The Beatles. Oh, what a great, great song that is. We're gonna head out, but thank you so much. Oh, no problem. Lois and Carol, thank you thank for coming. You. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Bye-bye. Hope to see you next time on the 28th. <laughs> Does anybody have a comment they wanna make? Like well, that. do you do you know that uh, Paul McCartney did write that about his mother, and his mother did tell him that. 
Oh. And after, after she died, um, he remembered that and wrote that song. Oh, I did not know that. Well, I have a couple more songs. Uh, this has been another another wonderful sing along through Zoom. Uh, I was saying that Beatles came out with Let It Be in 1970. It was released. And I am going to do a song by Carol King that came out the next year in 1971. Because it's all about friends. When you're down, you've got a friend. When you're down and troubled. And you need a helping hand And nothing, nothing is going right Just close your eyes and think of me And soon I will be there To brighten up even your darkest night just call out my name and you know wherever I am I'll come running to see you again sing it Nancy hey winter spring summer or fall all you gotta do is call and I'll be there yes I a friend If the sky above you should grow dark and full of clouds and that old north wind should begin to blow Keep your head together and call my name out loud and soon I'll be knocking at your door. You just call out my name. And you know wherever I am, I'll come running to see you again. Winter, spring, summer, or fall. All you gotta do is call, and I'll be there, yes I will, you've got a friend. Ain't it good to know that you've got a friend, when people can be so cold, they'll hurt you, yes and desert you. They'll take your soul if you let them, yeah, but don't you let them. You just call out my name, and you know wherever I am, I'll come running, running, yeah, 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 to see you again. Winter, spring, summer, or fall. All you gotta do is call, and I'll be there, yes I will. You've got a friend, ba -da 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 -da. you've got a friend, ain't it good to know you've got a friend, ain't it good to know you've got a friend. <laughs> Next time I'll do a song by Sondheim. Yeah, yeah. Uh, the one, the, I, I love the music of Company. That was one of my favorite uh, plays by Sondheim. There was just a wonderful um, celebration of his 90th birthday. Anyway, here's the deal. The only song I really ever learned of Stephen Sondheim, I'll do next time, I promise, May 28th, uh, Send in the Clowns. Well, I'm going to end today's uh, sing-along with the song that I started with because I believe in music, I believe in love, and there are a couple other verses that I didn't sing. So I'm going to sing the whole song. I 
could just sit around making music all day long. As long as I'm making my music, ain't gonna do nobody no harm. And who knows? Maybe I'll come up with a song to make people want to stop all their fussing and fighting long enough to sing along. Here's your part. Ready? I believe in music. Whoa, I believe in love. Yes, I do now. I believe in music. Whoa, I believe in love. Well, music is the universal language and love is the key to peace, hope, and understanding and living in harmony. So take your brother, sister by the hand and come along with me. Lift your voices to the sky. Tell me what you see. Here we go. I believe in music. Whoa, I believe in love. Thank you so much. I'm just going to say a couple of words in wrapping up. Um, Barbara Lee, you do such a nice job and people really appreciate you sharing your talents with us. And again, um, Thursday, May 28th, we'll be doing another sing along. So feel free to share that information. I'll post it to the blog and be pushing that out on social media. And in closing, I just would um, encourage you to like, click, and share when this video comes out so that other people can watch it. We've had people watch the YouTube videos um, quite extensively. One person in two days had watched it like 29 times. <laughs> and then we've also, you know, been asked, uh, some people have wanted to make in-kind donations. And if you want to do that, you can just uh, contact me and I on that, but we don't want anyone to feel obligated in terms of doing that as well. Again, thank you so much. I'm going to unmute people. And if there's any comments that people have, please, uh, please feel free to share them. This is Bob talking. Thank you You're again, welcome. Barbara Lee. You're welcome. I want to say thank you, Laurie, for putting this together and hosting this. It's really been a blessing and a wonderful thing. Great experience. And thank, you. thank you. Thank you, David. Okay. Go ahead, Harry. Yeah, I'm very happy. It was a very good show. Thank really you. Harry is 95 and a half, and he does go to sing for the moment. He actually, we know, Lois Jean. So this was a nice program for him to be able to participate in. Good. Fantastic. 
thanks for sharing that. And, uh, we hope you will join us again on the 28th. Oh, I certainly will. Okay. Good. Then, thanks, Harry. All cool. right. Thanks, everybody. Okay. Thank thanks, you. Barb. It was great. Good. Was fun. Bye, -bye. Really nice. Thank you. Bye, everyone. Thanks, Lori. Thanks, thanks Lori. Lori. We'll see you all on the 28th. Bye now. Okay. Hey everybody, Jared Sebesti, your host of Retire Repurposed. This podcast is dedicated to help people transition into fulfilling and purposeful retirements. Retirement is a big life change. In fact, the two most dangerous years of a person's life are the year they were born and the year they retire. Few people could just flip the switch from working a career 30 or 40 plus years retiring on Friday without methodical steps to living what we call a repurposed retirement. To listen now, search Retire Repurposed on your favorite podcast platform, Senior Resource, or Life Audio.